sport for us. And Josh, Australia's hopes are on the line tonight. Sure are, Lou. And Alex Dimonor is bringing the fight as the Aussies look to join Serbia in the ATP Cup final. But it hasn't started well for Kyrgios, under siege by a sizzling Spain. A timely reminder from Maxi as his replacement soaks up the subcontinent. And history beckons as Glory's golden run continues. Australia has their backs against the wall in their ATP Cup semi-final against Spain after a straight sets defeat to Nick Kyrgios. The pressure now right on Alex Dimonor as he locks horns with world number one Rafael Nadal. Australia's hopes rest on this man, Alex Dimonor, in the hot seat at nine news. Ominous signs ahead of the Australian Open with Serena Williams into the final of the Auckland Open. The 38-year-old has a real shot at her first piece of silverware in three years after smashing teenager Amanda Anisimova in just 43 minutes. Absolute. It feels good. I've been working really hard for a couple of years. My daughter's only two and I tend to be really hard on myself. But, uh, you know, considering everything, um, I'm doing pretty good. Williams will meet fellow American Jessica Pagula in the final after she defeated Caroline Wozniacki in three sets. He's been lighting it up in the big bash, but Glenn Maxwell has conceded he didn't deserve a call-up for Australia's one-day tour of India. In his absence, there'll be a shake-up of the batting order with plenty of spots up for grabs. Well, minus news. The glory have equaled a club record five straight wins with a comfortable victory against Adelaide United. Chris Economides shaking his form slump, getting back on the score sheet in the 3-0 win. The scorching 35 degrees greeted the Reds, but they quickly put the heat on the hosts. Dominant in all facets but the scoreboard, and the reigning Premiers made them pay. But it finds its way through. Joel Kianese hitting the back of the net for the third straight game, spurring the glory into life. Get up, Franich finds himself unmarked. And good save by Izzo. Bruno Fornaroli pouncing on the stroke of half-time. The crowd urging him to pull the trigger. And it is brilliant from Bruno again. The danger man wanted more. How's the chemistry for the Perth glory for Kianese? No. Inches away from a third, United desperately pressing for a quick response. The Glory making their first change with the struggling Chris Economides back on the park, and he'd have an immediate impact. He's gone at this open, and Chris Economides, he's been forced to wait for his opportunity, but he steps up and takes it. The result moving Perth back into third on the A-League ladder. And drama of plenty at the Magic Millions on the Gold Coast. Not only did a truck crash delay the feature races by almost an hour, when they did resume, this runner got spooked. That's how it happened. And that is Leviathan for Pete and Paul Snowden. While favourite Alligator Blood eventually took out the Guineas, it was outside a away game claiming the $2 million Magic Millions classic. Can they catch her? 50 metres out, away game. She's away with the game and she's away with the prize. Away game handing Kieran Ma his second winner for the day. So it wasn't a great start for Nick Kyrgios in the first game, but Lou, Alex Dimonor has just taken the first set against Rafael Nadal. He really is a fighter. You can catch the rest of that semi-final right here on Channel 9 straight after the news. A good excuse for a Saturday night in. Sounds good to me. It's <laughs> going to be a great match. Josh, sure. thank you. Thanks, Lou. See you tomorrow. From your mortgage